This video is of 1017 San Mateo Drive in Punta Gorda, Florida. This house is located in Punta Gorda Isles, which is a waterfront community. It was made with man-made canals. Canal is about 105 feet wide. This house sits on a very fast axis, can be either sailboat or powerboat. Home was built in 1997. It has 2,615 square feet, all tile floors, salt water heated pool. It's a very pretty house with very high ceilings. As you can see, there's a custom tile work there. Very high ceilings, plant shelves. All tile. Of course, when you walk in, the view is of the pool and of the water. I'm going to go over here to our right, and on our right is the study. It has also has high ceilings with crown molding, tile floors, there's one of the bedrooms. Again, it has high ceilings with crown molding. Tile floors. Nice size closet. This house has got a lot of storage. It's kind of unusual because a lot of houses seem to lack storage and storage is so important in Florida since we don't have any basements. So this is one storage, one closet. And then this whole wall is all closets. As you can see. Plenty of closets. All the way down. This is the bathroom, the guest bathroom. There is a pocket door. It's also got a linen cabinet. <coughs> Walk-in shower. Got a little bench in the shower. Nice high ceilings and it's also got a light. Here's one of the other bedrooms. Also has crown molding. All the rooms pretty much have fans, which are really great also in Florida. It's got a nice size closet. And you can go out to the pool this way. This door right here in the living room is a pocket door that will open up all the way. There's also a small bathroom out here and a shower to rinse off after you swim. I'm going to walk down here and look out at the canal. 
This is the house from this side. I'll do that view first. This is what it looks like from this side. This is the master bedroom. Master bedroom is about 16 feet by 17 feet, so it's a really nice size. And as you see, it comes off to the eye. It also has kind of a unique thing here. It's got this little box where it has the controls for the pool, so you can actually turn the heat up or, or turn the uh, just make all your adjustments while you're still in the house you don't have to go outside i'm going to walk down by the water right now and then i'll come back and look at the master bathroom in just a minute there's a hose spigot out here As I had mentioned before, this is either powerboat or sailboat access. It's very fast. You would actually go out the Ponce de Leon Inlet. These are all your neighbors. There's one vacant lot across the street that's available. Um, I forgot what the price is. It's Between three and three and four hundred thousand, I believe. This is a picture of the lift. Such a beautiful day here today. You can hear the birds singing. It's just perfect. One more look at the water. And then we're going to go in. As I believe I mentioned, this pool is a salt water heated pool. Master has crown molding, tile floors, nice and large. It also has a his and hers closet, both of which are walk-ins. Really nice size. Nice high ceilings, they all have lights on them. That one was just a little bit smaller, this one's a little bit larger. You should be able to fit all your clothes in here. This is the master bathroom. Also has a linen closet. Got a pocket door here. Lots of cabinets in the bathroom. Two sinks. Whirlpool. And a walk-in shower.
Right next to it is the laundry room, which also has plenty of cabinets in there. As well as the washer and dryer. Nice little sink. More cabinets. There's a little corner cabinet here. And a pantry over here. Or just a closet if you don't need the pantry. To the right will be um, the garage. We'll go there in a second. This is another closet. And it does have central vac in the house. This is your dining room. There's your kitchen. It's got a nice little island in the center. Solid surface cabinets. Really a pretty color. Some of the cabinets have got glass, so you can really show off your things. Nice little eating area right across there. Also got some bar stools so you can sit and talk to the chef. Okay, we're going to head out to the garage now. This is a two-car garage. There's the central back over there. Lots of cabinets out here too. And another sink. A little workbench, some more cabinets. Lots of more places to store stuff. You can never have enough storage in Florida. It seems to be one of the biggest problems we have is coming up with enough storage for everybody's stuff. So this house has plenty of it. Anyway, that concludes our tour. If you have questions about the house, just contact your local realtor, or you can put the address again in the Google address page and you should be able to find more information that way. The address again is 1017 San Mateo, S-A-N, Mateo is M-A-T-E-O, Drive in Punta Gorda, Florida, 33950. Thanks for joining me.